The Battle of Britain took place during World War II from July through September in the year 1940. The Battle of Britain started with bombing and rising streams of air attacks. Germany's objective during the war was to wear down Britain's air defense. Before the Battle of Britain, Germany thought Britain would agree to compromise peace, so they hadn't originally planned on this battle. It wasn't until July 2nd, in 1940, that Hitler even considered fighting. Germany was not prepared, their staff wasn't properly trained, and no landing craft was built. Germany had very low confidence, and they knew they were going to lose. By late August in 1940, Britain had lost just over 260 aircrafts, while Germans had lost 600 of their aircrafts. Now, a few special words from this Great Britain soldier. Oh hi, I'm part of the Royal Air Force, and winning this battle for Great Britain would block all possibility of German invasion and create conditions for our survival. Next, we'll hear a few words from this German soldier. In sich für uns hatte Great Britannien für die Invasion freigelegt. The British Royal Air Force definitely had an advantage over Germany because Germany had no consistent plan of attack. <laughs> During the battle, Germans accidentally dropped bombs on civilian areas in London. This benefited the Royal Air Force because it gave the number 11 group relief. The British retaliated by unexpectedly launching a bomb raid on Berlin. Meow. London was attacked for 57 consecutive days. British fighters were shooting down German bombing planes faster than Germany's industry could produce them. On October 12th of 1940, Hitler announced that the operation was off for the winter. German plans for Britain invasion were completely discarded. The campaign against Britain henceforth became purely a blockade of its sea approaches conducted by submarines, therefore meaning Britain had won the battle. Before I end this presentation, I would love to give a special introduction to, you guessed it, Winston Churchill. Churchill was the Prime Minister of Britain. He spoke before the Parliament on June 18, 1940. He announced that the Battle of France had ended and that the Battle of Britain was only beginning. He warned them and told them to brace themselves.